hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel thank you so much for coming if this is your first time thank you for coming and if this if you're returning for the second time because it's my second sit down video um thank you for returning um i really appreciate it and thank you oh my god i just wanted to say thank you to every single one that watched that video i really appreciate you guys so you don't you guys don't even know <laughs> It took a lot to sit down here right now to do this second video I can record without showing my face but sitting down and showing my face and talking in front of the camera it took a lot so for you to encourage me from my last video thank you so much thank you I wanted to say thank you god bless you every single one that watched that video and put a comment also and encouraging me in the sec in the comment section thank you so much um i sit back afterwards and watch that video over and over again i'm like oh my god i see so many mistakes especially coming from my number one mistake is my uh, makeup maybe i shouldn't say that up here you know what it is what it is i don't know how to not talk <laughs> That makeup was horrible. I mean, I'm not saying this is perfect, but I think it's better. I think. If you think my makeup is better than last video, my first video, please put a comment in the uh, comment section. Yeah, I don't know how to do makeup. I'm still learning. I'm learning. I'm watching YouTube and I'm Maybe by the time I do a couple of videos, over time I'll watch and watch and watch and learn more. So, yes. Uh, so just take it the way you see it. Just accept me the way I am. That's just basically what it is. You know, I've been thinking, oh, I don't want to do this all because I don't want you to judge me. And I just did it. First one, first video. And you guys watched it and you put nice comment. Thank you. So here I am, back in the second video. Anyways, I talked too much. I just want to say thank you so much for coming back and also for liking my first video so now today my video is uh the video today is a get to know me tag i mentioned last time that uh i will be doing a get to know me tag video after, excuse me after the last video so yes so this is a get to know me tag i have some questions right here in this book so if you see me looking down it's because i have questions that I'm gonna be answering I have a couple of questions maybe about 20 something or 30 questions I can't remember I will be answering them one at a time so you can get to know me um, and yeah so uh, let's get right into the video let's get right into the video okay so uh, the first question is my name my name is Omotolani Omotoyosi Bangbade. That's my name. My first name is Omotolani, and middle name is Omotoyosi. Very few know about my middle middle name Omotoyosi, but my first name. A lot of people call me Tolani, 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 but my full name is Omo Tolani. And only my mom called me by my full name, Omo Tolani. That's how she calls me. So, yeah, that's my name. Next question. Age. So, age. <laughs> Let's just say I'm close to 40. Yeah. I'm starting YouTube late. I know. It is what it is. That's just life. Thinking, I will do this how it never did. That's how many years? I can't even remember. Eight years. You know, since 2015, I've been saying I'm going to open this channel. I never did. So, yeah. So, I'm close to 40. Late 30s. That's my age. And what month were you born? November. Yeah, so I'm Sagittarius late November, November 26th actually that's my birthday uh, where I'm from I'm from Nigeria uh, yeah but I live in Canada yeah. next question where were you born I was born in Jos Jos Plateau State and that's up 
north north side of nigeria um so i was born there i i lived there until i i was about seven or eight years old and after that uh, we moved to ibado or your state uh, my both my parents are from Ibadan on your state and all my family are from Ibadan even my husband's side of the family parents everyone is from Ibadan so we moved to Ibadan so I usually call myself Omo Bado because everyone is from Ibadan my family I was just born in Jos and lived there for seven to eight years and then I moved to Canada when I was about 16 years old so yeah i've lived in canada longer than i've lived in nigeria but either way i still consider myself as omo ibado um what language do you speak i speak of course english yoruba which is uh, our native language and also i speak a little bit of Hausa. you know like speak maybe well speak i understand you know one or two three words I speak little, very little. Um, yeah, I used to speak and understand very well when I was when I used to live in just in the north because that's mostly the language there. And since we moved, um, I lost, you know, I lost it because um, there's no one to speak the outside to. So yeah, but I do understand a little bit. It's very tiny bit of Alsa any siblings yes oh my god that's a whole lot any siblings i have lots of siblings yeah that's what it is i have one younger brother that's you know from my mom and my dad same mom same dad just one so just two of us for so my mom and my dad but my dad have lots of wives yeah and i have a lot of brother half brother and half sisters that's another story for another day but yeah i have a lot i don't even know how many we are can you believe that i don't even know exact exact how much brother and sister i have after oh my god it's embarrassing so embarrassing yeah i have lots of siblings um yeah so i'm the first for my mom but i'm number five I'm number six for my dad yeah and i have lots i don't even know how many i have so yeah i have lots of siblings yeah it is what it is next question what do you do I i'm a nurse next question how tall are you how tall am i <laughs> i'm laughing you know why i'm laughing I'm laughing because when I go somewhere and they ask me, I'll tell you, I'm like, I'm 5'7", I'm 5'8". You know, I'm not. Come closer. I'm 5'4". Five 5'4". Four. Five four. Yeah, I'm 5'4". I'm short. Well, not too short, but not that tall. So, yeah, that's my height. Don't tell anyone. <laughs> next question uh okay uh, do i have any friends growing up um i don't have much friends growing up uh, there's a point in my life that i have lots of friends and it was such a it was just too much drama and then i cut down how much of friends i have and as i grow older i keep cutting off so I, mean, I don't know not like i'm cutting them off but um my my friends are just getting circle just getting smaller i don't know i don't know why but yeah so i don't have that much friends um i have very few friends right now i mean i have people who i talk to of course but when i talk about close friends i only have very few so and those school friends are probably watching yeah they are all my number one sub, uh, supporter so yeah and if you're watching hi so next question um was i bullied as a child oh yes of course i was bullied as a child um 
when I was back home, I was bullied, but I don't even know that it's called bullying. Is it only me? Maybe I'm weird. Am I weird? Is it only me that doesn't know what bully is back home? I didn't even know what bully is back home until I got to Canada. Even when I got to Canada, maybe a few years after, before I know what bullying was, I swear I did not know what bullying is. Oh my God. I got bullied until later in the day, later in, in my life, and I realized, oh, okay, so that that's what bullying is. So the, I was bullied. So yes, I was bullied a lot when I was younger, but it's okay. You know, it is what it is. I'm sure every kid, you know, even if it's not every kid, at least mostly, most kids go through this, you know, so it is what it is. Next question. Um, favorite color. I don't have a favorite color. Um, but what I can say is I do like bright colors, like white, pink, blue, um, yellow, mustard yellow. You know, the only color I don't really like is red. It doesn't mean that I don't wear red, but I just don't really like red. I don't really wear red actually, you know, maybe one percent of my clothes you see red, but yeah. So yeah, but I like bright colors. Favorite food. I don't have a favorite food. It just depends on what I'm feeling at that moment. Uh but the most food I enjoy eating are like food I make you gain weight. I'm still trying to work on my weight. Anyways, let's talk about this. <laughs> um, I like rice. I like bread. I like tapioca. Yeah. But I don't have a specific, like, favorite food. I don't. Next question. Favorite movie or TV shows? Oh, gosh. I love This Is Us. Have you seen This Is Us? Oh my on Netflix it's series I watch all the five series within like four or five days I really really enjoyed that movie oh my god it was so nice so beautiful very emotional I cried I laughed I you know it's just a mix of emotions but you know, it's so nice I really enjoy if you haven't seen it I would recommend number one recommend it go watch it and the next one I would say is uh, uh, King of Boys I enjoyed it yeah especially this last one that was uh, that was done last year was it last year or the year before it was really nice okay I did give up I'll give it to her yeah she was really good writing that story next question favorite music <laughs> I don't have a favorite music per se. It's just what I'm feeling at that time. Do you understand what I mean? Most of the things just depends on what I'm like. I tend to change a lot. I don't know. Maybe I'm weird, but that's just me. One minute I like this, next minute I don't like this. So, but for right now, I'm enjoying Asha K and I love um organized area that person organized. I love that song yeah i really enjoyed that song um so i love like i'm loving his music right now and uh artist i, I love asha K and i love the video i love whiskey whiskey oh give it to you i love his music next question uh any pets no i don't have any pets if i play any sports um a little bit of soccer. I believe every African kid <laughs> plays soccer one or the other at some point in their life. So yeah, you know, soccer a little bit and baseball. I used to play baseball with my half uh, brother and sisters back in Joss when I was younger. I don't remember those days. I think those that's just the only good memory thing I remember about my half brother and sisters. Yeah. So I do play baseball. I like baseball. Next question. Uh, 
describe myself in three words. So I would say ambitious, communicative, and reliable. Yeah. I think that's what I can say for now. I can think of right now. Next one. What's what is my biggest regret? Biggest regret. I don't know. I'm still trying to think. It doesn't mean there isn't. I just can't think of one right now. Biggest regrets. I don't know. Yeah, I can't think of one right now. Next question. What is the thing in your life you are thankful for? Mm. The thing in my life I'm thankful for. I'm thankful for being a mom. Oh my God. My friends watching know what I mean when I said I'm thankful for being a mom. Um, if you're not someone who know me, you probably don't know about it and which I'll do a story time or, you know, tell, you know, say one or two things and do a video about that on a separate video. But yeah, but I'm thankful for being a mom. Yeah. That's, one thing I will say for now, yeah. Thank you for my family. Okay. Next, next question uh, Do I have a good relationship with my family? Yes and no. Do I have a good relationship with my family? Yes and no. Yes, because I, of course, I do have a good relationship with my husband, kids, immediate family, mom, brother. But no, because I don't have a good relationship with my half brothers and sisters. We don't even talk. <laughs> yeah, I'm not ashamed to say it. At the same time, I'm not proud to say it. But yeah, I don't talk to my half brothers and sisters. I talk to my cousins, but my half brothers and sisters, nah. That we have the same dad, different mom? Nah. I don't have a good relationship with them. So, sorry. Next question. Let's move. We move. <laughs> Anyways, next question. Piercing or tattoo? Uh, piercing, of course. Tattoos? No. I can't do tattoos. Oh my God story let me quickly share this about 10 years ago i think 10 or 9 years ago i can't remember how many years exactly and everyone was doing those eyebrow tattoos you know that you do not the one they're doing right now not the micro blading micro um what is it called not those ones but the one they used to do back in the day like almost a decade ago I, everybody was doing it. I was like, oh yeah, I want to do this too. I don't have to keep shaving my eyebrows. Let me go get this done. My friend did it and she gave me the number and I went just to this Chinese, no, not Chinese, Filipino. She's Filipino. I went to her and I was like, you know, yeah, I want to get this. I paid. I can't believe I actually took my money and go pay for something. So that, oh my God, it was so embarrassing. So painful. I would never ever do that maybe that's my biggest regrets yeah maybe that's what it is i will never do that again in my life and that's one of the reasons why i haven't done microblading right now because it's so painful i went in and i was screaming like a dog oh my god the lady was like i can't do it you have to wait you have to wait i'm like no even though she put freezing i was still feeling the pain guys this is it was too painful. I didn't even go back for refill. You know, I'm supposed to go back. I think after two, I didn't even go back. I paid for the refills, but I didn't go back for the refill. That's how painful it was. I would never do tattoo. Never again. So piercing, I don't mind piercing. I'm scared of needles, but at the same time, I don't mind piercing. I wanted to do another ear hole in my ears and maybe a nose ring. I'm still thinking about it. Everything I'm doing late in my life, I don't know why, but it, it is what it is. So, yeah, maybe, you never know. Maybe next month, next year, I may do a nose drink. So, yeah, piercing for sure. 
Katsu? No. Next question. Cats or dog? I'm not an animal person, but I would rather, I would rather do dog than cat. I don't like cats. We used to have cats back home, and I hate cats. Yeah, look. Huh? Well, maybe, let me, you know, hate is so strong. I would just say dislike. I dislike cats. But dogs, I don't mind dogs. Yeah. Coffee or tea? I love coffee. Tea, yeah, I do drink tea, I don't mind tea, but I prefer, of course, 100% coffee person. Once I go back to work, I have to have my coffee every morning. You know, right now, breastfeeding, I can't really take coffee, but yeah, coffee for sure. I'll take coffee over tea. Next question. iPhone, Android. Android, of course. Hi phone. I don't know how you guys do it with high phones. Oh my god, people who use iPhone, I give it to you guys. Honestly, you guys are amazing because if you can navigate through every single thing on iPhone, kudos to you. I can't, it's too complicated for my life. My life is so simple. I can't stress. No. Android, yes. But using iPhone, I can't do it. And that's what my brother used. Everyone in my family use Android except for my brother. He can do without iPhone. But anyways, yeah. No iPhone. Android. Morning person or night hall? Of course, night hall. <laughs> morning person. I'm not a morning person. But being a mom, you have to put yourself and be a morning person, which I have to wake up early. But otherwise, I don't like waking up early. Yeah. So, I'm not a morning person. Introvert or extrovert? Um, I'm both. Reason why I said that is because um, I'm shy if I don't really know you yet. I'm really very quiet, reserved, you know, don't really talk much. But once, you know, we get to know each other, oh yes, I'm hyper. <laughs> I'm that kind of a person that once I'm, I know everyone around me and I'm there, you think I'm drunk and I don't even drink alcohol because I'm just the life of the party talking. Yeah, yeah, da, 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 da. But if I don't know you or if I'm not aware of, you know, who you are, I'll just be quiet. So that's why I said I'm a little bit of both. And then the last question is, Action movie or romantic movie? Romantic movie, yeah. Action movie is nice, it's just that anytime I'm watching action movie, my heart is like racing. Because like oh, okay. I'm just screaming. <laughs> if you are like me, please put a comment down below. <laughs> Maybe I'm just weird. Uh action movie, I'm jumping up and down. But uh, romantic movie, it's nice. It's nice to watch romantic movie. I'm an emotional person, but at the same time, I enjoy romantic movies. So, yeah. So, that's pretty much it. So, that's all the questions I have here. So, thank you um, for sticking around. If you've watched this far and you haven't skipped or stopped, thank you so much for watching. Um, I really appreciate it. So, uh, I'll post more in my next video um yeah but for now i guess that's pretty much it thank you for being here if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my youtube channel please support me support your girl <laughs> i'm new at this uh so please subscribe to my youtube channel put a comment share tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend and uh and like my video please and please no bad comments i can't deal with bad comments so far so good so please yeah thank you Bye bye